I mean, it's part of this larger thing of, you know, who do you trust? And recently there's been an attack, not just on the media, but on academia, on, you know, politicians, on the government bureaucracy in general. Um, basically anyone who you would consider an expert. And the, the risk for that is that if, this, if you have no one that you can trust, then, you know, truth kind of doesn't have much of a meaning anymore. So that's a, um, that's a, that's a problem. Um, and unlike, you know, a, a politician who has an agenda in terms of, you know, wanting to make them seem very, uh, uh, very good and, and their, their political views seem very attractive. Um, you know, the news media, their goal is to, is to inform you. Um, not all news media is perfect. Not all news media is, is, you know, perfectly altruistic. Um, but generally speaking, journalists, those who have that passion for the crap, because it's not, it's not a good way of making money these days. Um, they do it because, you know, they want to have an impact on the world. They want to educate the, 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 the world. They want to, um, you know, make a difference. So, you know, it doesn't necessarily mean you have to trust all media, but you have to trust someone who's out there who doesn't have skin in the game, who has a, uh, you know, a, an open mind and wants to get you the facts as much as possible.